The Ukrainian army is surrounded in Avdiivka. The Russians are preparing for a new massacre. The Russian army is trying to surround Avdiivka from the southern and northern flanks, according to the reserve major of the armed forces of Ukraine, military expert Oleksiy Hetman. The interveners did not plan frontal assaults, but rather to surround Avdiivka to make it impossible to supply everything necessary in the city. We understand that there are operational depots there and you need to constantly deliver water and food and evacuate the wounded, everything that's needed to support the army for combat operations. There are no stores there, so they're trying to cut off the supplies and control these routes with firepower, he said to RBC Ukraine. The expert explained that in this way, the enemy is trying to bleed the defense forces in Avdiivka and near the city. In an interview with RBC Ukraine, military analysts note that the situation in Avdiivka is frankly difficult. Currently, the occupiers have concentrated about 40,000 troops in the direction and are pressing from the side of Vasile and Krasno Horivka from the north and the side of Vadyani and experienced from the south. The other day, Russian troops took control of the highway that connects Avdiivka with the mainland, notes military expert Vladislav Zeleznov. He added that today the distance between the pincers is only seven kilometers. If the invaders succeed in occupying Olivka in the north and the villages of Tonenke and Severne in the south, the situation for the Ukrainian army will be extremely difficult. The chances depend on the resources of the Ukrainian defense forces. If we have shells, then all their chances will turn into a pile of meat which the Ukrainian artillery will mix with the ground. If resources are insufficient, the situation will be difficult and our troops will conduct a maneuvering defense, including retreating to the west of Avdiivka, Zeleznov says. At the same time, analysts repeat that Russians do not have any special military sense in the strategic plan for the occupation of Avdiivka. Trying to seize this direction, the Russian army does not spare human resources, literally cutting down on Avdiivka.